Tom. Hello, everybody. Tom Fox here. Back to more Mario Plus Rapid Sparks of Hope in the last episode. Uh, we got the crane working to go exactly where we need to go, but first we got this one darkness puddle of Courageous Duo. First, get to only use Mario and Edge. My analysis reveals that this darkness puddle is extremely formidable. Why don't we skip this one? After all, we don't have to remove every dark mess puddle, do we? Forget it. I can't do that, Beepo. Mario and I got it covered. Ah, oh, great fighters! And you complement each other well, too! If anyone can defeat this dark mess puddle, it's you two! And so we shall! Dangerous duo! It's a bunch of big boys! And I gotta defeat them all. All right, I settled mainly on movement and weapon tech for Edge, and I settled mainly on um, weapon and ability tech for Mario. We'll see how that takes me. But we got a, quite the variety here. In fact, I thought, I thought the last time I did this, and the because this is this is the last thing that I that I uh, did in the failed recordings, and then I'll be caught up. I believe this is the last thing I did. Uh, well, we'll see how well this all goes over. These guys are really strong. Let's go. All right, let's gather these guys around. And based on the, based on my upgrades to Edge, I can just dash into this guy like, into these guys like 80 times. Oh, I need to get closer. Actually, they're all melee based, so I should be able to do something. This ought to do. So I could do bam. I could do bam. Move it. I could do bam. And I could do bam. That gives me enough to like move pretty dang far forward. I'm gonna move back over here with Mario. I'm gonna activate a thing and try to target the farthest thing away from me. Wait, I think that one moves upon uh, upon getting hit. Fortunately, nothing here is melee, so I can just stand in the middle of nowhere and, well, everything will be fine. Ooh, although, yeah, the only issue is that if I attack, then I won't be able to get the bonus damage from Mario's jump shot. Let's start with that then. Uh... Off you go. All right. He's gonna. Yeah, he's gonna move closer. Oh boy. He's not within range of. Well, I can do this. But he's got like full rage right now. Actually, what if I did this? And then... Yeah, the Magna Fowl is gonna be an issue as well. I already did the attract. Ah, oh, just out of range. I have nothing else I can really do, so let's give this a shot and hope to God we do something good with it. Smack, 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 smack. Explosion, smack, smack. That one's dead. Please. Oh my God. Oh my God. Ah. That was so close. Please, please don't let the Magna Fowl be like, close enough to do its thing. Um. Can't really go too many places here. I figure my next best bet for the time being while I'm waiting for these guys to approach is just to like start picking them off with Mario. 
I gotta be careful about his range, though. Let me see how far he moves. Because the Magnafowl, the Magnafowl sucks! Technique is that far away. Movement is around that far away. Combining those, I could probably make a decent living here. Oh, I didn't want to hit the other one, damn it! Right now my idea is to wait for, um... Oops. I forgot that he can still move after he does that. My idea is to try and, well, since neither, none of them can fire anyway. Try to wait for the disco ball to come back. Then I can just slide into them. Hopefully he doesn't have enough range to do what I'm thinking he's gonna do. Here comes another one. Now the Magnafowl! Go! Please don't summon! Alright. We still got one more turn on the... Oh, actually, I could do a little bit of, of damage here. Dash. Dash. Now dash away. Oh god, dash away, dash away all! Oh no! I put her in the worst spot! On the bright side, she can't be summoned. On the downside. Oh man, is she gonna get a face full of it? All right. As long as I'm, f I gotta be, f I gotta be close enough to be able to shoot him. Though is the thing. All right. Let's get two sneaky shots on him, and then we'll go ahead and go into Overwatch. Did she have anything left? Hit him with sword. I still got two actions, so why don't I do this? Do that, and then we'll go ahead and go into Overwatch with Stormblade. And hopefully that works out for me, because this is going to be a nightmare otherwise. That did so much damage. Alright, I'm free. He already uses ability, so I so I'm a little bit I'm a little bit safer. Just a just a touch, just a touch safer. Actually, maybe I can get over to him and stomp him. Nope, it's not gonna work. And now I'm in range. Range. Overwatch. Get far enough away where she can still attack, but she's not gonna be like hurting. I'm just gonna try and peek you. See, that wasn't so bad. Actually, I could have vampired and slid. Good lord, what am I doing with my life? No, that's the wrong one. I can get her health back! <laughs> With the power of vampirism! Lifesteal! 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 Off you go. Alright! Get two off! Drop down! Let's go! Overwatch! There's honestly no reason not to do that. Mario plus Rabbids, it just works. I 
could kill him with the sword, or I could do something funny. I'd prefer to do something funny. Overwatch, and then, and then we summon him. How fun will that be? He's coming to us. Hi there, friend. Bang, bang. God, imagine if that interaction caused a glitch. Yeah, we're both crossing our arms. We are the best, the two of us. You and I, Mario and Edge, and me. I am the commander of this ship. I am the conductor of this crazy train, and I say no orphans. Apparently I had a Ubisoft Connect upgrade. I should probably explain that. During a D&D &D session, my friends were, uh, were, oh no. I mean, like, it's, it's weird that they just let you escape that, no problem. Anyway, they, they had, like, a bunch of, uh, of orphans in a, in, like, some sort of, like, pocket dimension where, like, they were safe. And in order to test a, uh, in order to test a, uh, a, a wormhole to see where it went, they were gonna tie an orphan to a rope and, and lower it in. The DM got so mad he put on a, a train hat, a conductor's hat. Uh, pulled out a uh, train whistle, blew it, and said, I'm the conductor of this crazy train, and I say no orphans. Anyway, I probably could have fast-traveled there instead. What ho? And a multicolored arena! Protect the turning mechanism. Oh, no. Oh, no. I have to protect, I probably don't have to keep all four up, but there are eight turns I gotta do this. What are we looking at? Got some barrels. Magnafowl and a splasher. Is it just once they touch the mechanism, we're, that's it, we're done? Kinda deal? And we got the riptides as well. Okay. Got options for exits. This definitely seems like it was made for Luigi, so I'm putting him in. It's just the other two I have to consider. Alright, I think I've got a pretty good team going here. It's just gonna be very unique to see how this functions. Let's get into it. Oh, okay, they each have a certain amount of hits. So, getting rid of the ones that have range, like, say, the Aqua Goonies. Aqua Stooges, excuse me. I keep calling them Goonies. Goonies are already an established Mario enemy. But, I can get... a lovely bird's eye view from over here. I can't hit that guy, so I might as well start going for this guy. I figure attack him and then put on, uh, put on, uh, what's it called? Oh, yeah! Uh, Overwatch. Start by there's really nobody in range right now. I think it's good to have because of the splash guy there. I think it's good to have cover more than anything. I wish that could reach. Doubly so for Mar for uh, for Mario here. Um, okay, I've I've got a plan. myself some cover and get sort of close to these guys. Wait, what the heck is that? Does that electrify this? I have no idea what this is. Well, I'll find out at some point. Something tells me they're gonna be useful though. Worth it to jump down just so I can actually, yeah, because I can get the hits off on them, and then I would have cover. Come on. Oh, but I forgot that. Get back up, get back up, get back up, get back up. Oh, I forgot that they have the power to attract me to them, so I don't want to do that. Uh, I think we're good for now. Let's pass and see. That one's just dead, and that one's getting there. Oh my god! Oh, 
that one's moving up. Well, so much for that. Okay. Presumably they are gonna be going for me. I can't hit anybody with that. That's only really if they get like super close. We've got a single spell razor coming out over here. I assume this electrifies it. I'm, I'm not gonna test it out unless I'm in a really dire situation here, but it's good to know just to be, just in case. Also, that could have been real bad. All right, let's try this. Luigi's right here. Let's give the power up. They both have the power up, good. Um, unless I'm able to get somebody in between them, I'm not gonna be able to hit them both. Unless. So close. I, I'm, I keep backing up against the wall there because of the cover. Yes! Can't believe that worked. This this probably will kill him. Let's be let's be real. I can at least get some damage in though. Oh, you know what? I can make this a little bit easier on myself with Luigi. That's actually wrong. Oh no. I, oh no. Uh, oh, oh no. Oh, oh no. I've already used both my da- Oh no. Yeah, oh no. I should have shot from the other side. Okay, you know what? I, I, I have to do this. I got at least- Oh, I can get them both! I think. Oh no, I'm hitting that. Which is showing it doing damage, but probably not as much as I'm hoping for. Oh wait, I can- I- What? I can- well, dang, dude! Let's do it. I am in range of him. Can I back up any further and still get them both? Ooh, yeah. I am still within range. You know what? I've got the I've got the recovery thing. Like it, it's it's fine. Plus, I can see what this thing does. All right, they're both dead. Good, 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 good. The stooge is right there. So let's go ahead and, you know, hide. Uh, I think we're good for now. What the flip? That is stupid AF. God damn it. This is actually a little bit more troublesome than I hoped it would be. So what happens if I hit this? It's not showing him taking any damage. That didn't seem to light anything up for him. I'm confused and also curious. Percent chance to crit. Oh, I see. Flipping, flipping, dipping, dipping dots. Okay, well, this one definitely has to die. I'll go on Overwatch. I think I can make this work, possibly. 
Uh, she took a little bit of damage, so actually maybe doing... I can call people to me as well. Yeah, if I do that, I'd be able to get... So yeah, let's let's call these two together, and then I could slide into them, and then really give them something to, to cry about. Let's give them something to cry about. How about it? Oh, if I do that, then Luigi's gonna shoot at them, though, is the problem. They're definitely in range, too. Um... Okay. Let's do- let's do this, then. Vamp dash! One! Up to who? I'm actually kinda surprised by that one. Let's go... Oh, for God's sake! It was the bounce! Oh wait, I could do it again. <laughs> I was so mad. Oh, I was so mad. Okay. Dash. And then dash. I think that's all my health back up. Well, I could do the old dash dash splash, maybe. Maybe I can angle it so I can hit. No, I don't have a. I don't have a uh, line. A line of sight on that. Good lord. I can't lift those up. Um, it's possible the splash will knock them into the abyss. So let's try that. It did not knock them into the abyss. They're so close to death. Meanwhile, over here. I could go for punchies. Um, actually, punchies might be the. I c actually, how far can I go? Because I may be able to reach that one and just kill him outright with the punchies. There, boy, sa there by saving Luigi's um, attack for that thing over there. Unless these things know how to strategize, in which case, I'm screwed. I actually don't think I can make it to that. Come on. Jump. I'm a jump. Oh no! I've. Oh my god! I've ruined it. I've ruined it and there's no going back. Alright, well. End the turn. Let's see what happens. That one moves. Which I'm honestly surprised about that it didn't get killed there. Is that two more Stooges? Yes. Okay, no portal has opened up, so that's that's good at least. Can I... You know what I probably could do? If I go up here and then drop down, it might give me enough... Yeah, that's what you're supposed to do. Unbelievable Bubba. Well, they're taking shots at them pretty much every turn. You can go die. Ugh. Didn't increase my range by that much. And there's nobody to call! Not even the Ghostbusters. She does have extended flight, I think. Ah, she does not. Extended flight would have been the way to go here. All right. Let me see if I can lure them into attacking me instead. I think there is one other person, isn't there? Or is there a portal? Light pole, light pole, light pole. It's just light poles, man! And they're all behind cover as well, so... Oh, what if I did something real dumb? Okay, since... I, maybe it would still count as the higher ground? I gotta be way closer to get that to work. Wish I could undo my moves! One thing I like about Fire Emblem is that you can see, like, the the attack range as well after movement. So it would've been nice to be able to see that. And I can't... 
cannot reach. Oh, but I can make it so uh, Rabbit Mario can reach. Hey, yes! What is up, dipshits? See in range of the explosion. Make sure I'm not. I, I don't think Rabbit Mario is within range of the uh, explosion. Let's find out with these punches. <laughs> I sneezed them away. How do you like that, Daddy O? Meanwhile, ah, Luigi can get back pretty close to being back up on his perch. Whoa, ho, ho, yeah! Luigi! 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 Eh. Alright, that's about as good as I can do here. Let's end of the turn. Nothing coming out. We got a new portal. We got two new portals coming in, which means I need to... Oh, shift. There is a big splashy boy coming out of that one and a big splashy boy coming out of that one. Well. Come on. Well, then. How close is that portal? Probably don't want to be much closer than this. It's like that one movie about the baseball field. If you if you build it, they will come. Well, if you sort of like stay in one particular spot, then they also will. Oh, that's a magnafowl. Come on. <laughs> I don't want to be terribly close to that. I do, however, wish to turn on. Actually, oh my God. Wait, where is she in range? Yeah. Ah, no. Oh, that might be a really good idea to just do that and go on Overwatch, but I don't have to do I don't have to do every, uh, something every turn though. I think just Overwatch will be fine. Then I can power everybody up next round, keeping them sort of. Oh wait, she could be in range. Either way, she's in she's in range pretty much no matter where she is on this. I'm really hoping he's not close enough where he could walk and then summon or not uh, or attract rather. Here it comes. I'm so glad that one's out first because that one has more HP. No! Oh! oh! Oh my god! That's you know, that's okay, that's that's worrisome. Magnafowl, spell razor, spell razor, and splashy boy. Okay. Yeah. Ah. I can at least start by getting a decent chunk off on this guy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I won't have Overwatch until next turn. Yeah. You can tell I have at least some knowledge of XCOM because I keep referring to the to those abilities as Overwatch. It's actually another turn where none of these guys can. Oh wait, actually, Rabbit Mario, you know, can do something. He could, and in, in, this is only a theory. He could kill this guy. Thank goodness. Explode! Explode! Are you? You are not good for death, my good man. Oh, I ran out of root. Can I still throw the sword? Yes, surprisingly. Well, then we're doing that. You know, the good thing about being flexible is knowing when to pivot. Aha, okay, so if you attack that enough, it does put out an electrical shock. I don't know if it hurts me. I don't know what it exactly does. I don't know if it stuns. She'll go for the Magnafowl, so I'll jump down here and then... God, the... I, I was like, oh man, I needed more flight. Actually, the, what I realize is now is that like the flight time doesn't affect jump pads. Actually, no, I need to stay fairly close. Because I need the... Oh, actually, I'll, I'll be fine. 
Okay, and we are... I think we're good. Is she a cover? <laughs> no, but it should be fine. I don't have a lot of turns left at this. It's not like they're just gonna immediately come down and destroy me. And here come the spell raisers. Summon a man. Another spell raiser. Another spell raiser out here to summon a man. One fight after another. All right, we are pivoting. Actually, maybe I could just make them go the opposite direction. Oh, what's the range on the screamy thing? Not very far, unfortunately. Though in theory, I, sh I could be able to just jump down there and make them run in the other direction. Uh, Luigi on the other hand. I think going on Overwatch might be the smarter move here. I probably actually should have given Rabbit Mario the uh, the ability to uh, define life and death here. I can go lightning and then take one big splash attack from him. Then Rabbit Luigi could finish him off. If I attack him, he's gonna move. That's the biggest issue. So I think Rabbit Mario's gonna have to take one for the team. Uh, yeah, that'll get rid of the... That'll get rid of the stooge. Oh, that doesn't give me a lot of room to walk, does it? Oh, boy. Yeah, because I think taking... That is, that's not enough to kill him? That is concerning. I should be able to make this work, though. If I give myself enough leeway here... Should be able to give myself, let's see, how much is this gonna do? 500? How much else? Okay, so one more and then Luigi can finish him off. Then Edge can go back this way and start dealing with this chump. Cause I might actually be able to do what I set out to do. Hit. And then, another hit. And then, how many, I can make two of them go away. I think the Spell Razor has enough range in order to be able to hit it from wherever it ends up. Uh, let's try it. Oh God, oh Jesus, oh no. I mean, that's like right at the edge of my range. Uh, Luigi, Luigi. <laughs> Guaranteed death! All right. oh, yeah. Over, over, watch. I think I gave Luigi the wrong spark abilities because some of these aren't really working out in my favor here. Shit's not going the way I thought it would. I don't know if, the, if I have to protect all four, but, you know, I'm still able to make stuff work. There's still a spell razor. She still has moves, but... There isn't much of a point. I actually want to see... Okay, so that does electrify the floor. I've done everything with everyone, so... I'm just kind of surprised by that. 
surprised by that too. I'm angry by that one. Really? Spell Razor. Somebody know another little dude. Yeah. All right. I don't think either of these are close enough. Oh, Rabbit Mario. God, I wish I had a shoe because I'm gonna need to take out that spell razor. Hopefully if one goes down, it's not like, it's not the biggest issue, but I do have a small issue here. What I need to do. Right, how far? This, yeah. There's no way this range is that far. Yeah. I can still team jump though. So putting both of them down there might work out for me. Then get rid of the spell razor. I don't. I think there's one. There's a spell razor over there too. Is there another one? I think just a stooge came out the last time. Uh, let me do the tactic cam. There's no point in, in trying to go for this guy because I don't think he's got the range to uh, to make it there. Yeah, no, he's he can't make it. There's just a stooge over there. That one can take a hit. There's two long range people over there, so I need to get them over there. Or out from back there, rather. Okay. So, I should still be able to get Luigi up on high enough ground where he's dealing crits. Does he have overwatch this turn? No, I used it last turn. Okay. Uh, Luigi time. That should be fine. I just need to bring them closer. So I can get them both. Na 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 na. All right, now she can go over. She can get just right up in their grills. Let's hit both of them. Yes. Uh, let me get that team jump. Fly, Luigi! If that's from a different game and they didn't record new lines for this game, then I am shocked, I tell you. Shocked and appalled. Yeah. Oh, dang it. Oh, wait, I can get her over here. I can't get him any closer, though. Yeah. Jiminy Jellickers. Yeah. Oh, there we go, I got him! Let's get that turbo charge, because yeah. we're gonna need it! Up there. Hopefully this counts as high enough ground. What did I, wait, I did the power up? Oh, and I did the attract, so I can't hit anybody from there. Well, that's unfortunate. Most unfortunate indeed. All right. Um. I mean, yeah, let's just. Move it. Dash, 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 I'm gonna hit them with dash. Tuna! And get a kill now. One dash, day. dash, dash. I'm running quick Jeez. as a flash. And I'll be the hero. <laughs> Pepperoni. Extra cheese. I still have my weapon. And I think both of them still have. Because honestly, all I need to do is kill either the Spell Razor or the Stooge. 
Which shouldn't be too difficult. Man, maneuvering around this map is very rough. Okay. Let's start making tracks. Making tracks, kicking ass, kicking tracks, taking names, naming tracks, Mario Kart. I am. In case you didn't know, I am a jump. Uh, she has both of her action points too. He doesn't have electricity right now. He's got counter blow. I'm kind of surprised the fire one didn't hit. Also, I'm surprised at how little damage that did. Good lord. Off you go. Here we go. All right. Is, will the dash kill? Yes. Dash you wants to kill. Dash you wants to. Ah! Mortally wound. Oh my god. This, uh, oh well, then that worked out great ex for everybody except for her. Edge is in a, is in a little bit of a bad way here. Oh no, oh no. So that'll take damage. Are you, oh thank goodness, he's stupid. Ha! Got you. Ah! You got me. And ha ha! Victory for Vegeta! Oh yeah! Luigi time! Purified darkness energy crystal obtained. Battle was won. Pizza was cooked. Looks so much nicer out here. Oh god, and then there's that. I like the patch on its head. Beepo, everyone! You endured the windmill! Given the intensity of the storm, I was concerned that your odds of success... Concerned? Why, Genie, if I didn't know better, I'd say you are downright panicked on our behalf. Are you broadening your emotional range? Hardly. And regardless, this isn't the time to focus on me. We should make contact with... Mama, here! Hello, dearest friends! I'm ever so grateful to see you've repaired my wind machine! See you! <laughs> I thought we could celebrate with some of my cucumber water and pimento cheese sandwiches. See you in my garage! Also... Also, uh, this is Mama. Goodbye! Beepo, does anything about that transmission sound strange to you? Obviously, my keen leadership abilities and decisive work in the field has considerably brightened Mama's outlook. Though I agree that pimento cheese sandwiches are an odd choice given the warm weather. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I dare say. We've purified one out of two darkness crystals. We got experience for it. And things are looking up. Mama's payback. We gotta return to Mama's garage. Next time on Mario Plus Rabbit Sparks of Hope. I think has the area opened up for us anymore now that we've uh, we've taken care of that? Because there's still a lot of different Yeah. The path is clear down here. Next time Mario Plus Rabbits, we're gonna be exploring more of the uh Barrendale Mesa. And uh probably return to Mama, maybe? I don't know, probably not. Maybe, mayhaps, who knows? See you all next time, later!